Welcome back to Miss Universe. These finalists have all shown they have the drive and determination to make it to the top 10. But after swimsuit and evening gown, 10 becomes five. The selection committee has spoken and I have the results right here. The first contestant to make it to the final five is Puerto Rico. Still alive in the competition is Vietnam. Earning spot number three is Philippines. Locking down the fourth spot is South Africa. Six women are still hoping to advance to the next round, but there's only one spot left. Keeping her dream alive is Venezuela! Say hello to our final five. One of these amazing women will become our next Miss Universe. As exciting as it is to make it this far, our contestants have no time to celebrate because right now they face the question. Miss Universe takes on a great responsibility working as a global ambassador. She must be sharp, quick on her feet, and able to communicate with clarity and confidence. Contestants, get ready because your answers will determine who makes it to the final three. Tonight's questions were written by some people who know you very, very well your fellow contestants. Now, once I read your question, you'll have 30 seconds to deliver your answer. When your time is up, you'll hear this sound. Puerto Rico, Vietnam, and Venezuela will be using an interpreter. Here we go. Puerto Rico, please join me at center stage. How are you? Great. <laughs> well, here's your question. Hundreds of journalists across the world were jailed this year for writing stories that were critical of their governments. Why is freedom of the press important? Cientos de periodistas fueron encarcelados este año por haber hecho reportajes que fueron críticos de sus gobiernos. ¿Por qué usted piensa que es tan importante tener la libertad en la prensa? La prensa está para informarnos. Eh, nos debe mantener al tanto de las cosas importantes que están pasando en el mundo. The press is there to inform us. Their job is to give us the news about what's happening in the world right now. Creo que ellos deben tener total libertad de publicar la realidad de lo que está pasando. They should have total freedom to be able to report exactly what's happening. Sin olvidar nunca que deben ser sensibles y deben tener empatía, porque hay muchas personas que están sufriendo por los problemas que hay en el mundo. Without forgetting that they have to have sympathy because there are a lot of people that are suffering different problems in the world. Capunca. Thank you, Puerto Rico. Vietnam, you're up. How are you? I'm very good and very happy. Thank you very much, Miss Universe. Well, here's your question. The Me Too movement has sparked a global conversation. 
In response, some have said that the world has become too politically correct. Do you think the Me Too movement has gone too far? Phong trào Me Too đã làm thế giới nói chuyện về nhiều. Em có nghĩ là phong trào Me Too có nói quá, quá không? À, bản thân em uh, không nói quá. Bởi vì khi mà bảo vệ sức khỏe con người hay bảo vệ làm dụng tình dục, bảo vệ con người, bảo vệ phụ nữ, đó là một cái quyền rất lớn. She doesn't think that, I don't think that it has gone too far. Protecting women and women's right is the right thing to do. Con người chúng ta cần được bảo vệ và trong cuộc sống của chúng ta cần được tự do và cần được bảo vệ. Cảm ơn. I need, women need protection and rights. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Vietnam. Philippines, it's time. How are you? I'm good, Steve. I can't believe it's top five already. <laughs> well, it's here. Uh, here's your question. Canada recently joined Uruguay as the second nation in the world to make marijuana legal. What is your opinion on the legalization of marijuana? I'm for it being used in a medical use, but not so for recreational use. Because I think if people were to argue, what about alcohol and cigarettes? Well, everything is good, but in moderation. Thank you. Thank you, Philippines. South Africa, step right up. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Uh, many countries across the world are experiencing an increase in immigration. Do you think countries should limit the number of refugees allowed across their borders? I think that every country should have their own rules and regulations, but for a thriving society and for all of us to stand together, we have to understand that we are all human. And we all are more alike than we are not. So we should be open to loving each other, accepting each other. Doesn't matter where we come from. Thank you, South Africa. Venezuela, get ready. How are you? Hi, I'm excited. Yes. Well, what would you say to someone who believes that pageants are archaic and against the feminist movement. ¿Qué le diría una persona que piensa que los certámenes de belleza son anticuados y que van en contra del movimiento feminista? Hoy en día estamos en una era en la cual hemos avanzado muchísimo. Nowadays we live in an era in which we have advanced greatly. Los certámenes de belleza no son solo de belleza, también son de sensibilidad, de responsabilidad y de corazón. Beauty pages are not just about beauty, they're about sensitivity and about having a heart. En ellos podemos mostrar que jóvenes como yo podemos lograr alcanzar todas las metas que nos propongamos en el mundo. In beauty pages, we can show that women like me can achieve any dreams that we may have in the world. Thank you, Venezuela. Well, our five finalists, our five finalists have just answered some very difficult questions. And now our selection committee must decide who's still in the running. When we come back, these women will face another elimination. And later, it's our final look with a performance by three-time Grammy winner, Neo. This is Miss Universe.